Turning to Crime Beat now, Reno Fire Department is investigating multiple small arson fires that happened last night and early this morning. Jamie Hayes is live at Hobby Lobby on South Virginia Street, where one of the fires was reported with the latest on this investigation. So, Jamie, what can you tell us? Well, Landon, the fire here at Hobby Lobby just started around 8 a.m. this morning, and an employee had to be treated for smoke inhalation because of it. The first fire was in a dumpster that started late last night, just before 11 p.m. at Plumas and Glendale. In total, there were nine fires that occurred, three near Plumas and Glenda, one on Brinkby, one here at Hobby Lobby, and then at the Barnes and Noble nearby. Most of these fires were dumpster fires, but throughout the night they came closer to buildings, such as an apartment. One even caused some damage to the exterior of a building. Firefighters say that this could, these fires could have been much worse. The wind is, is uh, as strong as it is. It doesn't take much, even on the small fires that were set with the brush and with the cardboard and the trash, it doesn't take much for the wind to pick it up and spread it to the neighboring structures. As of right now, the suspect is described as a male. Investigators are looking at surveillance and speaking to witnesses right now. Uh, Secret Witness is offering a $1,500 reward for the arrest of the person involved in these arsons. If you have any information, please call 322-4900. Covering the story live, Jamie Hayes, Channel 2 News. Jamie, thank you. Also in Crime Beat, police are investigating.